Welcome to the first time usage video of the full SIM object scanner. Developed by Thomas Conover. This video will show you how to use the scanner for the first time. At the left side you see Second Life. At the right side you see the scanner window. When you purchase the scanner in Second Life, you will receive a package that needs to be unpacked before you can use it. First you need to res the package on the ground. Then you left click on it to open the unpack window. Then you click on the copy to inventory button. This will copy the contents of the package into your inventory. Now you can delete the package you rest on the ground. Then go back to your inventory window and right click on the scanner. Then choose where. You will now see a tiny HUD on your screen, located at the lower left side in your second life viewer. You will see a pop-up window appear soon after you wear the HUD that will tell you what to do next. Now we need to copy the connection key from Second Life into the scanner software. To do this, open your chat history window by holding down control key and then push the H key on your keyboard. You will see the connection key printed there. Use your mouse to select the key. Then hold down control key and push the C key to copy the key into your computer's clipboard. Now go back into the scanner software at the right side of your screen, and paste the key into the connection field. Then click the connect button. If the key has never been used before, the software will ask you if you want to save the key for later use in the connection manager. I highly recommend storing the key in the connection manager so that you do not need to copy and paste it every time you need to run the scanner. I suggest you use your own avatar name as the storage name when you store the key in the manager. The scanner will now connect and you will be able to see all objects around your avatar at all times. We will now shut down the scanner software and execute it again it's so you can see how to easily reconnect using the connection manager. To reconnect to a previously stored key, just click on the Connection Manager button located at the right side of the Connect button. Then choose the stored key you wish to connect to again, then click the Select button. Then finally you click on the Connect button and the scanner will start running within a few seconds. Now you can start using the scanner to find all the missing and hidden objects in your area. Good luck with the hunting. This is the end of the tutorial. Thank you for watching. If any problems or questions, please contact Thomas Conover for assistance. I also recommend watching the other tutorial videos on the website, this way you can learn how to install the scanner in multiple regions at once etc. This is a great feature if you are working as a state manager, where you need to monitor a large amount of regions at the same time.